Let us take a look at the book of Revelation chapter 2, verse 17. Whoever has ears, let them hear what the Spirit says to the churches. To the one who is victorious, I will give. What will he give? Some of the hidden manna. I will also give that person a white stone with a new name written on it, known only to the one who receives it. What we need to pay attention to here is who gives us the hidden manna. Let's read verse 17 carefully. Whoever has ears, let them hear what the Spirit says to the churches. To the one who is victorious, I will give some of the hidden manna. Doesn't it mean that it is God who will share the hidden manna with all mankind? Then, we should find the one who gives us the hidden manna, right? What truth did Jesus establish regarding the manna? It is the truth of the New Covenant Passover. Therefore, we must wait and find the one who gives mankind the truth of the New Covenant Passover. However, after Jesus came to this earth 2,000 years ago, and ascended to heaven, the church suffered greatly due to the persecution by Rome. In the end, all the truths that Jesus taught us disappeared from the earth. The Sabbath day, Saturday, was changed to Sunday worship. The Passover was abolished and Christmas was added instead. As a result, the earth became a dark world where there is no truth at all. That is why God said that He would come to this earth again in the flesh. Let's take a look at Hebrews chapter 9, verse 27. Just as people are destined to die once, and after that to face judgment, so Christ was sacrificed once to take away the sins of many. And He will appear a second time not to bear sin, but to bring salvation to those who are waiting for Him. 2,000 years ago, Jesus came to the earth in the flesh and had the same appearance like us. However, people did not believe in Jesus, but rejected Him at His first coming. Yet, Christ promised to come a second time in the flesh. How will you recognize Christ who comes a second time? At His second coming too, He will come with the truth of life, the Passover, which is the truth of the hidden manna. Then, we must keep in mind who gave us the truth of manna in order to lead us to the spiritual Canaan, the Kingdom of Heaven. Who is He? Who gave us the truth of the New Covenant Passover? Christ on Sang Hong came to this earth and revealed the truth of the Passover, which had been hidden for 1,600 years. Through this truth, He is leading us to the eternal kingdom of heaven. I hope all of us will receive the guidance from Christ so that we can enter the eternal kingdom of heaven. Furthermore, let us diligently preach this truth to many people.